Hey Gunpowder Crew, welcome back to the channel. Today's adventure, we are here at Hatfield McCoy Trails at the Ivy Branch Trail. Just met up with a really nice lady here. She told us that this is a Jeep trail because we wanted to make sure of that first and said there's another one that we can check out that's also a Jeep trail. So today we're by ourselves, but we're just gonna scout it out and see what this trail system has to offer. And if you haven't done so already, please subscribe to our channel, keep our channel growing. We love doing these videos and want to keep the adventures rolling. Also, like and share to your friends. As the adventure continues, let's hit the trails. As I said with our previous Bear Walla video, if you haven't seen that, go back and check it out. You have to wear helmets on all the Hatfield McCoy trails, whether you're on a dirt bike, on a four wheeler, or in a Jeep. So bring your helmet, follow the rules, keep these trails rolling as the adventure continues. just finished up on trail 10 which is an easy trail that leads you from the trailhead where we were out here and now we're gonna hit up trail 67 which is a difficult to see what it's all about as you can clearly hear a good thing to do is to air down your tires when you're hitting difficult trails especially if they're muddy like today so not a sponsored video but we love our Ironman All Country MT tires, 37 inches. As you can see, it's downhill from here. So let's get to it.
are now at the bottom of trail 82. It is a red and black trail. So it's extremely difficult. As you can see, it's a big hill climb, lots of <laughs> jutted rocks. It doesn't look the same on film as it does in person, some tight trees. So, Scully, I think we found our next adventure when we get back here. This is definitely more of a dry day adventure. Let's move on to another trail. Little Coal River, Ivy Branch, fishing and boating access. Cool. All right, here we have Trail 39 entrance. And of course, all your trail rules. On this trail, there is a really sharp right-hand turn that we have to make, so Gunpowder will proceed to make a three-point turnaround in the middle of the trail, and we have to really be careful because right behind us is a huge drop-off, and we don't want to go there, so just look at this turnaround we kind of have to do to make this turn. Another extremely difficult trail, 95. Of course, here's your sign. Most difficult for highly experienced riders only. Areas may require winch or four-wheel drive capability. Most difficult trails on the system. So we're gonna go over here and we go over here and check it out and See if it's another one we we'll want to put on our list. This is where you want to get to. Now here's a nice size ledge to come up. Follow it back to the front. So we start here, you squeeze between boulders, and end up back up there where I just showed you. Looks like a pretty fun trail. Pretty tight. What do you think? Maybe? Rocky? Rocky? <laughs> yes. So, we're going to get along down the trails as the adventure continues. Squirrel! <laughs> that squirrel gets around. It does. I don't know. Now we're rock crawling. <laughs>
girl. gunpowder crew we just got back from Hatfield McCoy Ivy Branch trail system and as you can tell we had an awesome time we checked out some of the easy trails and we hopped on some moderate and then we tried some of the difficult trail systems and they were a blast so we hope to get up there maybe next month maybe sometime this summer with a couple of the Jeep clubs that have showed interest, New River Valley and some of the West Virginia Jeep clubs also want to ride with us sometime there. So we're going to plan it out a little bit, hopefully hit the new trail system and some of the more difficult trail systems that we showed you today. So as always, please subscribe to our channel, like and share with your friends, keep our channel going and growing. 
love sharing our adventures with y'all as the adventure always continues here on our channel. We'll see y'all out on the trails.